Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Strictly Saturn. <laughs> and tonight, on the scary of all nights, we are reviewing D. Turn out the lights, close the doors, and prepare for the scary world of D. D is a bone-chilling, spine-tingling, first-person adventure where you control a woman wandering around a huge mansion and attempting to discover what happened to her father. The game is unique because it is played in real time, and it ends exactly after two hours after you start playing. Unless you finish it, of course. You can't even pause or save your place, so make sure you have two hours free before you undertake this intense adventure. The plotting pace made me feel impatient at first, but I soon got caught up in the creepy atmosphere. D is effectively frightening and has some generally intense moments. Chilling sound effects and ominous music are used effectively, and the first person graphics, although somewhat grainy, are good enough to immerse you in this dark world. Movement is smooth, but also very slow. Slow enough to make you retracing your steps feel tedious. Fortunately, the puzzles tend to be straightforward, so you won't get stuck in any room for too long. Your character automatically moves towards vital objects. And there are no red herrings to be found at all, at all people, none. Unfortunately, by the time you get to disc 2, the slow movements, the endless puzzles start to get tiresome. The replay value is gravely wounded by the fact you can never skip the cinematics, which are often lengthy and annoying. But overall, D is a spooky and worthwhile trip, at least for the first time. Now, D was very well received. But, like most full motion video games of its time, it didn't do very well. Even the magazine Game Informer rates it at the worst horror game of all time. I don't believe that's correct. D is a really enjoyable game. And if you're not into the horror suspense, murder mystery thing, then avoid this genre. But it's not full motion video. It's just a really good game. And if you're into the whole, you know, full motion video games, you will enjoy this game. That's all I got to say. This is Jeff, Strickland Sega, signing out. Until next time, folks. Catch you later. Sega! Ugh. Whoa. What happened? Ugh. What was that thing? Well, I guess there are stranger things out there. Need a drink. So, uh, whatever the heck that was, gone now. That's good. Let's see No. No, I'm not playing this. No. No. I'm gonna have to play this, don't I? <sighs> Looks like I'm gonna need a lot more of this.